I would like to uh, thank you for invitation of me. And in my presentation, I would focus on public participation because the other two other pillars of the ARS Convention, access to justice and the right to information uh, are without any great changes in the Czech Republic in last year. And really from the beginning of the Czech Republic from 1993, Till uh, 2018, the public participation was open not only for the neighboring owners, but also for the environmental NGOs without any great formal requirements. Um, to start an uh, NGO in the Czech Republic, it, it is enough if do you have three members proclaim goal of environmental protection you do not have to pay any fees either for uh, neither for uh, register the ngo nor for registering in the proceeding and the only big requirement was you have to focus on the um, information about the new proceedings because the uh, because you have to register within the eight days, which is not a long period of time. But for the right of the NGOs to participate, it we have seen the repeated attacks. I think it was eight, maybe nine more times in, in our legislation. And uh, unfortunately in 2017, one of these attacks was uh, successful. So from the uh, 2018, the public, public participation of the NGOs is really restricted. NGOs can participate now only in the projects which are felt within the scope of environmental impact assessment. But uh, we do have uh, really high limits for environmental impact assessment, so there are almost no projects assessed, especially in the uh, in the cities where there are no uh, no new uh, industry or new big uh, agriculture. There are all, almost no projects. It can, uh, I, I have counted and it's about really three, four, five, six, seven per year in the capital city of Prague. And it's a, it's a true for most of the regions of the Czech Republic. So uh, NGOs can participate in the projects uh, within the scope of environmental impact assessment, but we do not have assessed uh, almost any projects. Second opportunity uh, to participate are in the proceeding which are connected to cutting the trees or special protected species of plants or and animals. But it has also great uh, but these proceedings could not be related to any kind of constructions or building uh, or whatsoever. So it has to be individual proceeding. And in any other proceeding, especially related to constructions, building new buildings, uh, uh, building new shopping houses, malls, building new houses, uh, building new uh, communication road, uh, railroads, and so on, only the owners, only the neighbors, only the, only the physical persons can participate in this kind of proceeding. So just final remarks, and this situation has really great uh, effect on the activities of NGOs, because they uh, do feel that they could not participate in the really back most of the procedures in the Czech Republic. So uh, they are not so active. They do and they do not, as a result, they do not participate even in the procedures where they could because uh, the civic society feels now that 
that more uh, that easier and effective is a uh, way, way to participate is try to find some neighboring owners. And that's all for me. Thank you.